I'm safe. Late this afternoon, investigators found a teenage girl who had been reported missing Saturday from Huntington County. Yeah, ABC 21's Corinne Rose explains why Fort Wayne police played a major role in the search. In the police world, no man is an island and no department is an island. We all work together for the greater good. Sergeant Sophia rosales Catina says Fort Wayne detectives began searching for 15-year-old Ray Lynn Pebernat Sunday as soon as Huntington County called saying she might be in the Summit City. As leads rolled in, Fort Wayne, Huntington and state police detectives as well as FBI agents worked through Monday night and into Tuesday executing search warrants in the case. It's called mutual aid. And she says it happens all the time. They might not know the ins and outs of Fort Wayne or the, the scene of Fort Wayne, but we do have a lot of people that know a lot of things around here, and we will work with them to find some resolve. The Huntington County Sheriff says because of that cooperation, Ray Lynn was found safe and out and about in Fort Wayne Tuesday afternoon. He wouldn't get any more specific. The sheriff says detectives discovered a man near Ray Lynn had an outstanding warrant, so they took him in for that and are questioning him about any possible involvement in her disappearance. Huntington County detectives are interviewing the girl to hopefully learn whether anyone coerced her to leave her grandparents' home in Warren Saturday morning, where she visits every other weekend. They emphasize they have not made that kind of connection in this case. But police in general say they know that some kids can be vulnerable to being groomed online. And there are a lot of people that will take advantage, a lot of predators out there, um, a lot of people that will tell people what they want to hear at the moment to get them to do what they want them to do. Um, and we've seen a lot of that, um, you know, human trafficking is skyrocketing. Um, in this country and throughout the world. She says if any child or teen does not have a safe home environment and is thinking about leaving, there are better options. Any child watching this, if you're thinking about running or running, you don't want to go home because it's not safe, but you don't like the environment you're in now. Just reach out. Any police department will help you. We will find you a safe place to go. Raylin's mother, who lives in Ohio, is said to be on the way to Fort Wayne to pick her up. Corinne Rose, ABC 21.